Well, hey everyone, this is Shirish and welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm back with another one of the amazing UK University, Imperial College London or ICL. Well, in this video, I will give you an in-depth view of the university and will decode the academic, social and financial aspects of the university with my star rating. And then I will offer you the most important tips and strategies to get into Imperial. This knowledge and these strategies, if followed properly, can make sure you get guaranteed admission to this university. So make sure to grab a paper and a pen and take notes or save this video for your later reference by hitting the like button. But let's look into this amazing university, Imperial College London. Hi, I'm Shirish Gupta and I empower people to hack their success, rise above the challenges and confidently create an extraordinary life they deserve. Imperial College London is a public research university in London. It was established in 1907 by Royal Charter by merging three existing institutions. For some time, it was a part of University of London, but as of now, it's a standalone college. Eventually, a lot more verticals were included in the college campus, including the College of Medicine and Imperial Business School. Imperial is located in London, one of the largest cities in the world and capital city of United Kingdom. To be specific, since London is a very, really big city, Imperial's main campus is located in South Kensington, part of central London. It's one of the posh and sophisticated areas of the city filled with cultural and historical places like Victoria and Albert Museum, Natural History Museum. And not just these, the city is filled with places to explore and enjoy. Imperial doesn't have one defined section which is dedicated to the college. They have nine such campuses around London that are not limited to South Kensington only. They are Charing Cross Campus, Chelsea and Westminster Campus, Hammersmith Campus, North West London Hospitals Campus, Royal Brompton Campus, Silwood Park Campus, South Kensington Campus, St. Mary's Campus and White City Campus. Each campus has its own specialization and uniqueness students will enjoy. The campuses are connected with the college shuttle and can even be accessed using the vast underground tube network. Online campuses have different architectural look ranging from historic British to modern. In fact, in my opinion, all the campuses are so different that no one can tell them that they belong to the same college. The most popular majors at Imperial include Biology, Biotechnology, Medicine, Surgery, Chemistry, Engineering, Computer Science, Economics, Business and Mathematics. Although I'm not a big fan of judging a university solely on the basis of the ranking, you'll be interested in knowing that Imperial stands in the top 20% of colleges ranked in QS News in the world and top 1% in UK and Europe area. Alright, now let's move on to our next section talking about the right fit, starting with academic fit. Imperial College has a high performance and fast-paced educational environment. Imperial is a global top 10 university with a world-class reputation in science, engineering, business and medicine. ICL is focused solely on STEM, medicine and business. That means you are choosing to study at a school that is very attuned to what is being talked about across all industries at the moment. STEM, by the way, is science, technology, engineering and mathematics. Imperial offers a lot of programs with different ranges. Most of the bachelor programs here are three-year course format, with exception to few like engineering and medicine with four to five years format. Postgraduate courses experiences more variation ranging from eight months to 10 months to 12, 15, and a full-fledged two years graduation also. It also offers a lot of short courses on campus or recorded online short programs via online platforms like Coursera. Study abroad options and small webinar options are also available and very beneficial. All courses have general requirements, although implementation depends on campus to campus. Every student has core classes they need to complete and along with it general requirements and electives. Although electives have no specific conditions, most students keep the area close to their majors. The Imperial College School of Medicine is ranked number 3 in 2022 by Times Higher Education World University Rankings. The 6 years MBBS BSc program is the most popular program offered by the college. It works in phases starting with basic medical biosciences theory in the form of BSc, then the clinical research phase, then the journal practice phase before diving into complete MBBS education. Imperial is widely known for its medical research including major immunology research on COVID-19 vaccine that reached the human trial phase in 2020. Imperial was also part of the top 10 contributors to NASA's InSight Mars lander and even in history has been a critical contributor to discovery of penicillin, the invention of fiber optics and the development of holography. So an amazing institution. The faculty at ICL is highly experienced and liked by students. Well, most of them are involved in research in their subject, which gives them their taught courses that extra edge. They include 14 Nobel Prize winners and one Turing Award and over 200 fellowship combined with staff and student researchers. The class size at ICL is small to average. 
Most of the classes are around 20 to 30 students, but more popular programs like MBA can reach up to 100 as well. So keeping all this thing in mind, I would like to rate ICL with five stars on academic difficulty and quality level of five is the highest level. But after academic fit, let's move to social fit. Social life at Imperial can be amazing. Being part of London, a number of opportunities come your way to make the most of. The culturally diverse college as well as the city presents you with activities like visiting artistic historic museums and galleries, discovering the world's largest monarchy. There are a number of restaurants, pubs, bars on campus and also surrounding the campus, which has become a popular social activity for Imperial students. Imperial has about 380 clubs, societies and projects with a wide range from academic to social to charitable to sports. All these student organizations are managed by Imperial College Union. Proposals for new clubs are always welcomed by incoming students to cater to their interests. ICL has above 19,000, close to 20,000 students with about 10,000 UG and 10,000 as PG and PhDs. The university has a 59% student body as international students from all over 140 countries. That is really, really very diverse campuses in the world. Housing is guaranteed to undergraduates who choose Imperial. They have 23 campus housing options available for all students to select from. A number of variables from twin rooms to single to suite arranged can be explored as well. Imperial provides housing to graduate students as well. ICL offers GradPad, which are properties designed exclusively for postgraduate living. At GradPad aims to help students make the most of postgraduate student life. Based in two locations within a short distance from the main campus, students can choose from a wide range of comfortable, stylish studio flats in two superb locations in London. And if you like to, you can stay off campus as well. Well, each campus residence has meal plans for students to use around the campus with over 29 outlets, including cafes, restaurants and convenience stores. You're never far away from hot meal, refreshment or a quick snack. The food is pretty decent as well as for the students. Apart from the hostel canteen, a lot of on campus options are available. And not just that, living in London can come with advantage of exploring every cuisine that you like. Imperial College has over 60 clubs dedicated to sports. Rowing is the most popular sport at campus with college members competing in Olympic team. Other than rowing, sports like American football, rugby, badminton, lacrosse, football, ice hockey are popular with strong college teams. Sports like cricket, boxing, fencing are also available on campus. ICL offers competitive academics and good social life as well. I would like to give it 4 stars out of 5 on quality of life at Imperial. Now let's look at the financial fit. ICL falls in an expensive school category. You can expect anything about 30,000 to 35,000 pounds in annual tuition expenses for international students. For domestic and in, uh, students from Ireland, the tuition fee is about 10,000 pounds. The tuition fee range is actually wide since there are programs with 25,000 expenses to about some of the medicine programs which go up to about 45,000 pounds. The housing and dining may fall about 10 to 15,000 pounds range for the most. As far as financial aid is concerned, ICL does offer a lot of scholarship opportunities based on merit, averaging £10,000. A lot of third-party and athletic scholarships are also there. I would like to give it 4 stars out of 5 on financial fit. Well, after exploring the fit, let's move to the most curious section on how to get into Imperial or ICL with my special admission tips and strategies that can triple your chances of getting admission. The ideas I'm going to share come from my decade-long experience working with students for career and college admission. ICL is one of the elite colleges that are highly selective. The acceptance rate last year was about 14.5% and mostly ranges about 12 to 15% only with over 98% graduation rate, which is really very good. The college evaluates a holistic profile of the student. They won't just look at the grades, but rather at the all other aspects of your profile too. Essays, recommendations and test scores, they also play an important role along with your course scholastic activities. That is true for almost every university, but my videos are more than these basics. It's about sharing less known information and strategies for helping you really get into ICL or other top colleges. ICL has five core values that you must try to imbibe and show through your essays or personal statements or on any other part of application. Out of five, today I'm going to talk about three most important values that you must show in your applications through your essays or other areas. And if you have time, build your profile along with these core values, of course, if you, are, if you feel aligned with them. Number one is collaboration. Imperial totally is a place that values collaboration. In fact, their one-liner is together, we are Imperial. So the value of collaboration is so important for Imperial. At Imperial, students work together cultivating an inclusive and impactful college community. 
Talk about your experiences where you have collaborated with other students and teachers. Showing this trait in your application can increase your admission chances multifold. Another important value is excellence. Imperial aims for quality in everything they do, taking pride in their work, delivering an impact that is making a positive difference through their passion and commitment. So work on the excellence and the positive impact of your work. Just don't talk about what you did. Go further, talk about what impact you had. Also talk about your passion and show commitment in your profile. Well, the best way to show commitment is by getting yourself involved in something over a long period of time. So don't take up an activity like music or research or community service for just two or three months. Instead, commit to it for a long time, maybe two years, three years or even more. Doing one or two things over a long period shows your deep commitment. This is really very valuable tip. The third value is innovation. Since Imperial is STEM, medicine and business oriented school, innovation is really at the heart of the university. Talk about your inclination towards innovation. And it's absolutely okay if you haven't invented yet by yourself. Talk about how excited you are to venture into unknown. Talk about your open mindset and most importantly, have the courage to embrace the change. These are some qualities that can surely get you into Imperial. For basic requirements, academic grades are important for admission. So make sure to maintain a good GPA. For postgraduate, students must maintain a GPA of about 7 to 8 out of 10, depending upon your program and depending on the college you're graduating from. For undergraduates, a score of 90 to 92% overall across 5 subjects, with a score of 90 to 95 in relevant subjects is required. For IB, overall scores 38 to 42, with scores of 6 to 7 in relevant subjects at a higher level is required. There are a number of departments at Imperial that use admissions tests for their admission process as well. So make sure you're aware of them in advance, giving you enough preparation time. The application works in phases here, so before even starting the application, it's important to research well beforehand to avoid any last minute issues. Since the application works in phases at ICL, most of the students actually stop paying attention to admission pages for recent updates. It is absolutely imperative that you make a list of initial requirements before starting to work on them. ICL accepts undergraduate application through UCAS. The process is simple and deadline for medical programs is in October. The rest of the programs can go up to January, mostly 15th of January. That's the deadline. Unlike UGs, postgraduate application works in phases. Unlike most applications where you are able to submit everything in one form, Imperial divides the process into two parts. Part one includes the questionnaire about your profile, academic professional information. Part two is for documentation, transcripts, resume, personal statement questions, TOEFL IELTS, GRE GMAT, recommendation and supplements. The admission process is rolling till the seats are filled, but there are always program-specific scholarship deadlines that I recommend keeping an eye on. This can give you an additional advantage financially. Transfer applications are accepted between January and February every year, although every course has specific prerequisite that the applicant must meet before applying. In the end, to conclude, if you are interested in science, medicine or business or hardworking, social, okay with intense workload, interested in research, looking to create a positive impact with your work, ICL is for you. Thank you so much for watching this video. I really appreciate it. Please make sure to support my work by liking and sharing this video and also subscribe to my channel by hitting that bell icon. Thank you once again and I'll be back with another amazing video for you. Till then, this is Sharice signing off. Take care. Have a good one. See you.